Brett Park Park today, the home of the newest London club in the Barclays Premier League, and we're here to meet the club's longest serving footballer and to find out why goalkeepers are a little bit different. Hey, we're Kickmag TV, Leo Spironi, welcome. I did. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. We've always said that goalkeepers are a little bit different. <laughs> are you different? What makes you what different? Makes, crazy? Different well, you use the word crazy. <laughs> what makes what makes you different to be a goalkeeper? Well, I think the position on the pitch obviously is unique. Uh, as a player, you can play in different positions, but goalkeeper is only a goalkeeper. Mm. Uh, probably that's the that what makes us you know, unique. <laughs> you, what's the craziest moment you've ever had on a football pitch? What are the, would some people say that would be a typical goalkeeper moment for you? Oh, I don't know. It's uh, been played so many games. Uh, uh, I remember when I was in Scotland that um, someone shouted something to me in Spanish where I wasn't expecting it and it was so so funny. I just had to play a goal kick and it was so funny because I couldn't stop laughing. You know, and, yeah, probably that was one of, one of them. Yeah. Have you always wanted to be a goalkeeper? Is that something at a young age, was it always the position you wanted to be? Yeah, I, I started when I was nine years old um, playing for my school. Um, I was very agile back then and I liked to dive around and so they said oh you should be a goalkeeper and I tried and I loved it so since since then uh, I was been a goalkeeper. So um, and we're guessing that your heroes growing up must have been goalkeepers as well um, who, who did you look up to? Yeah I'm not sure if you remember Sergio Goicoche. Okay. Played yeah. 1990 World Cup in uh, oh, Italy. Right. Yeah. Was he Walter Zenga? Oh no it was Argentina sorry. For Argentina yeah. yes. Um, he saved four penalties mm -hmm. and I was growing up you know at that time and uh, I know he was one of my, my, yeah, my, yeah. my heroes. Mm -hmm. What about today? What sort of goalkeepers do you look at and, and think are oh, you know they are the, be the best in the business? Yeah, I, I try to look a little bit of everybody really mm. and try to you know take the, be the best bits and uh, learn from obviously when, when I'm playing, learn from the mistakes and try to, to improve my game. Uh, I wouldn't say I have one in particular, but yeah. I try to look around for for all the all the good bits. Hey, you've been at Palace now, and you need 400 games. Did you ever imagine that when you signed for the club? I can't believe it. <laughs> Uh, no, no, obviously no, I never planned it this way. Um, uh, it's not common on these days that the uh, players stay that long in a football club, and this is my tenth season here. So I'm, I'm very pleased it went this way, really, because I really enjoy my time. Here. You've come with a cult hero, haven't you? And I hear you've even got a restaurant named after you. Is that true? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, there's a restaurant downstairs. Uh, Have you eaten in there? Uh, yeah, 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 Christmas. We had Christmas uh, dinner there. So. So does it like Argentinian food or? Does no, it no, 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 no. <laughs> it's just, just a normal English, English uh, food. Well, maybe we'll head to, to Speroni's after lunch then. Well, goalkeepers might be a little different, but Julio is a top-class keeper, and he'll be trying to keep this lot in the Premier League this season. We're off to try a little bit of lunch at Speroni's now. Catch you later, Kicksters.